people have said that that was like a cherry on top. Like they already loved iCarly and then we made it like a little gay and they were like, yes. <laughs> that moment where Dutch and I kissed, when I say representation matters, I mean that like, I like to see television shows that reflect what's actually happening in the world and who actually exists. So if you don't ever see people who look like you, if you don't see sapphic relationships, then you start to think the way that you are and the way that you feel is abnormal and weird and not of this world, right? When you see people who look like you doing things that you enjoy doing or prospering and having fun, it makes you feel like you can do that too. The reactions online were very fun. Um, there were a lot of kiss cams. There were a lot of like memes and dancing. It's really special to me to be able to bring something to life that doesn't surround trauma or like a sad story, which is oftentimes what we see when we're telling queer stories. And those stories have so much weight and so much validity as well and need to be told. But I think it's something to be said about just being who you are and having a good time and not having to come out and nobody's crying and we just, you know, it's the norm. It was really fun working with all the queens. I mean, obviously, if you're doing drag, like, you know, you're funny, you're quick, like, well, if, you, if you're good at your drag, okay, if you're worth it. Um, and they obviously all are. I think, like, pride brings about a lot of fun ways to uh, put Carly in interesting situations. I think that maybe, hopefully, in the future, if we have another season, we might see some big gay storylines.